if you are anointed, if God has called you, if God has gifted you, and if God has ordained you to the nations or ordained you right here at your local church or wherever you're at, if it's teaching the junior high, whatever it is, you will meet opposition. You can bet on it. You can put your money on it. You're going to meet up with some opposition. And immediately the Holy Spirit said, that is not me. Take authority over this spirit. You are anointed for this time. And for an instant, I was between this place and this place of running and saying, I can't do this. I want my mama. I want somebody. Pastor, please come. And in my mind, I'm thinking, what I can do is I can turn this over to the pastor. And then I could, I could go up to the bottom, to the top of the stairs in the choir, get down on my face and hide and sneak out. But then there was something inside of me. All of a sudden, it rose up inside of me that said, the one that is in you is greater than the one that's in her. I told the church, I said, get on your feet and begin to pray as loud as you can in tongues. I said, in Jesus' name, we're going to cast this devil out by the power of the Holy Spirit. The anointing of God is going to destroy this enemy in her life. And they begin to get on their feet. I mean, I went up to that girl and I spoke to that devil. And I said, baby, I'm not talking to you. But I'm talking to the devil that's inside of you. And I come against you in the name of Jesus. And I tell you, you cannot stay in this body. You have got to go. There's somebody in this room tonight that the devil has come against your life, has come against your family, has come against your home, has come against your children. It is time you be bold and brave in God and stand up and say, I will not take it any longer. I am anointed. Jesus Christ of Nazareth, go! That little girl's body went limp. I was able to lead her to Jesus. She told me later, she said, Sister Judy, she says, I was involved with witchcraft. I was involved in, in, in the occult. Let me tell you something about the anointing. The anointing of God inside of you. The anointing, the anointing means to rub with oil or to smear with oil. It means to consecrate yourself. You are not your own. You've been bought with a price. Can I tell you tonight, women, that you've come to this, uh, to this conference and you've come expecting God to do something with you and in you, to you, and for you. The first step to going to the next level is to understand you are not your own. Yes. 